Good afternoon. Just here at the studio working on the teakwood, coconut, and hibiscus flower candles for the spring and Valentine's Day collection. So my job for today is to paint them and put the dried flowers in them. And I really like working with um, natural materials. Um, like dried flowers. This is what the hibiscus flowers look like. So they're dried flowers. They're really dark. But then when you put them in here, um, they kind of swirl around and the hot wax hits them when I pour it. And it turns it into like an abstract art piece. Um, and it's really cool. And then the white the pretty white um, soy wax. Use all natural soy wax and a wooden wick that actually burns like a little campfire and it crackles because it's um, wooden. I'll show you what one. That's what it looks like when it's painted, then it has to sit out and dry. So I'm just doing step one, but this is what. Um, there's two different variations. So this is what the finished product will look like. And we've already burned it. So, and that's the wooden wick that's burnt. And it's a teak wood and coconut scent, but then it has the pretty flowers for the art piece. And then it does, as the candle, the heat from the candle melts and burns down, it does give off a tiny hint of the floral from the dried flower. And then here is the second bigger candle. This is the second variation. Um, and this is all natural soy wax. This is an all natural, like the cleanest burning candle you can find. Um, so it has coconut in it, in it also on the top in here. And then this is what, this is the um, effect when you paint it more. Like, so this is like the lighter, the small lighter. And then this is when you, but it's really the same thing, just a different technique. And then it has the wooden wick and that's what it looks like um, before you burn it. It is really good. So there are those. Um... And I've also been working with some leather, and I made these leather earrings um, on golden um, fish hooks. Just a lot of fun stuff going on with all natural materials, mostly, anyway. And crystals. I don't know if I mentioned that yet, but um, I also love to work with crystals. And I'm exploring like the um, um, jewelry making with crystals. So we're working with a lot of fun, like lighter, like florals and. Um, Where's some of the stuff we have going on? Like a honey, orange honeysuckle lip balm, peaches and fresh cream, Cuban tobacco, purple sandalwood, um, rose clay and charcoal, vanilla bean, detox soap. Like a lot of rose and honeysuckle and tobacco. See what else? Oh yeah, and then the sprays, the sage, bergamot, and lemoncello spray. So I use um, a locally handcrafted organic vodka, and I make um, lemoncello, like an organic lemoncello. And then what I do is I use the lemoncello in any products that need. Um, sorry.
sorry, and any products that need like um, to be preserved, you know, like a, like a room spray or a body spray. So the, preser the preservative for that is the um, organic limoncello that I make. Because just um, like rubbing alcohol and stuff like that, it just is too harsh. And the limoncello serves two purposes. One is an amazing preservative, but it also smells amazing. And it's non-toxic. It's good stuff. Oh, and bath teas, like green tea and rose with um, pink Himalayan salt. So that's going to be another goodie. I'm putting really pretty glass jar. Love glass, anything glass, crystal, wooden, leather, all good stuff. So Valentine's Day is coming up, and I guess that's when you celebrate love or the ones you love, but I'm going to be going to the courthouse that day and giving me myself my new name for Valentine's Day, it's a little, a little gift to myself. I'm excited about that. <laughs> Something I've been looking forward to for a long time. Hmm. So I'm going to keep here just getting these done all set and prepped and ready to go and then the next step is going to be to get the wooden wicks in which is a whole nother process and then get the jars ready for pouring and then Mix the wax with all the fragrances and oils and essential oils and the coconut and then pour and then actually pour them. So. And note to self, I need to grab a lighter that works. <laughs> so I've been told, just, just saying, no, I'm just kidding. I love all the comments, um, so thank you everybody <laughs> for all the comments and encouragement and helpful tips. And definitely to all my subscribers and viewers, shout out, love you guys. <laughs> Just hope everybody has a good day. Love you all, and to life, liberty, and the pursuit of happiness.